touch me again, Tristan, and you're going home in a body bag. With my catapult <laughs> turtle, I can launch my dragon Damn, champion yo. toward your Joey's castle. Joey's man gangster in this, bed, in this episode. What's good, y'all? This is your boy Leo. Today, we'll be checking out what you guys recommended, which is more Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridge. In this case, we'll be doing two episodes at a time. And again, this is gonna be episode 10 and episode 11 since we got like fucking 80 episodes and nobody got time for that nigga. So let's check this out, all right? Ooh. Who keeps throwing these cards at me? It's not funny, you know? Stop it. No, my harpies. I can't my believe harpies. I lost. Maybe next time you'll put more than three monsters in your deck. I'll be taking your star <laughs> chips now. Super Logic. special awesome rescue. We heard screaming. Is everyone okay? I lost another duel. You were screaming because of that? What are you, five years old? It was very distressing. We were trying to sleep. Honestly, this is exactly why I hate blonde people. Calm down, Joey. <laughs> and you're Bloody blonde dunk. yourself. She was my easiest victim yet. Her huge breasts were no match for my enormous chin. Don't worry, Mai. <laughs> Since I'm the main character, it'll be a cinch for me to win back your star chips. Time to recycle my sexy transformation sequence. It's time to duel, sucker. Do, 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 do. Dig it. Dad Yugi's one bad mother. Shut, Shut your, your mouth. mouth. I'm just talking about Yugi. Then, then we, we can dig it. It looks like it's my lucky day, Yugi. Pegasus has offered a vast reward to anyone who can eliminate you from the tournament. Yeah, maybe you could use the money to buy yourself a voice that doesn't frighten small children. I'll teach you to make <laughs> fun of me. Hey, these things must come in handy. Oh, wow. Well, for what, I wonder? <laughs> Yugi's in big <laughs> trouble. I agree with Mai's boobs. This is the worst <laughs> vacation ever. <laughs> it's so much fun <laughs> being a bully. You know something, Chin Face? You look like the illegitimate <laughs> offspring of Jay Leno and Tim Curry. <laughs> with the Castle of Dark Illusions on my you side, know what, Chin Face? Shut your mouth. Monsters Shut will be hidden of from boy. sight, making things much easier to animate. I cast magic missile at the darkness, revealing <laughs> your side of the field. I say, oh, that man. was a superb strategical move at a critical juncture. Who the hell said you could hang out with us? Thrill as I set all Damn, my how many stars in defense has? mode. Stalemates are very exciting. Jeez, this is a really lousy episode. It reminds me of our spin-off show, Yu-Gi-Oh! DMX. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, all right. Honestly, who would want to watch a cartoon about a bunch of rap artists playing card games? Hey, I like that show. <laughs> Touch me again, Tristan, and you're going home in a body bag. With my catapult <laughs> turtle, I can launch my dragon Damn, champion yo. toward your Joey's castle, man shattering its location rings, thereby causing it to collapse on top of your monsters. This card game is a load of bollocks. If I can't beat you, Yugi, then I'll kill you instead. I fell into a burning ring of fire. I went down, 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 and the flames went higher. Why aren't you dead? As I explained earlier, I'm the main character. You, however, Bitch. can just go right ahead and die. Mind crush. Bullying is just wrong. Destroying people's brains with magical powers is A-OK. -okay. Could I have my star chips that. back now? Only if you beg me. Ah. Come on, get on your knees. <laughs> <laughs> You're kidding, right? Did I stutter or something? Bark like a dog, woman. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, this boy is a savage. Oh, wow. Oh. <laughs> Bark like a woman. That's fucked up. That's very fucked up. 
anyways guys let's check out the next episode in this case uh, this is episode 11 uh, that we're gonna check out now and let's again Boop. previously on Buffy the Vampire Slayer just kidding it's only Yu-Gi-Oh I have to reach Pegasus's island fortunately I can pilot a helicopter Thank God for Microsoft Flight Simulator. Once I get there, I'll probably bump into Yugi. I'll never forget the way he beat me in a card game. I can remember it like it was just yesterday. Wait a moment, did you just summon a bunch of monsters in one turn? Yeah, so? That's against the rules, isn't it? Screw the rules, I have green hair. Huh, <laughs> well that was just weird. I should probably cut down on the drugs. Come <laughs> Oh man. Rich people and their drugs. Look, Bakora, your Millennium Ring is acting really peculiar. Oh, that's just my gaydar. My father had it installed in my oh. Millennium Ring in order to protect me, because I look so bloody effeminate. I wonder why it's wow. pointing towards Pegasus's castle. <laughs> Bugger if I know. This tournament is simply fabulous. Ooh, let's celebrate by watching the Spice Girls movie. Oh, not again. I say, that reminds me of the time when I was transferred into your school. Oh, Kids, man. this is our new student, Bakora. Not only is he new here, he's also British, so feel free to bully him like crazy. Hello everyone, it's bloody nice to meet you. What's wrong with his voice? Is he a girl? Go back to Russia. I wanna go home. You blokes are a bunch of wankers. Checkmate. I sunk your battleship. Joey, you redefine what it means to be a mora. I was watching you play card games with your mates when my Millennium Ring started pointing towards your Millennium Puzzle. I can't imagine why. This uh, is simply <laughs> fabulous. By the way, where uh. are the others? Joey and Tristan are busy guarding Taya. For some reason, ever since we got back from the Shadow Realm, she's been under the impression that she's a caterpillar. Soon I'll be a beautiful butterfly, and then Yugi will love me. Oh my, a helicopter. I wonder who it is. I hope it's Santa Claus. Look, it's that guy I defeated in the first episode without even breaking a sweat. Hey, loser, how's it going? <laughs> I'm here to kick ass and play card games. And I'm all out of cards. Here's your deck, Kaiba. By the way, I've forgiven you for hospitalizing my grandpa. Can we be super special awesome friends now? Like hell. I don't have time to waste with you Scoobies. No offense, Yugi. You're a great duelist and all. But your buddy over there couldn't duel his way out of a paper bag. That does it. Nobody <laughs> talks about my pal Tristan like that. Oh, I don't damn. like to be touched by people who don't have money. Yeah. Joey, are you okay? Yeah. Check his pulse, Yugi. It's time to duel, you big palooka. This looks like the perfect opportunity to stroke my ego. Behold, the briefcase of death. This contains the prototypes for my revolutionary new dual disc system. So tell me, Wheeler, are you ready to be completely emasculated in front of your friends? I was born ready, Kaiba. Go, Armored Lizard! I think Beyblade's gonna sue somebody. Battle Word Ox, up. Axe, Smash Attack! You duel like a dairy farmer. How appropriate. You duel like a cow. Joey's sucking even worse than usual. <laughs> Keep a stiff upper lip, Joey. So here's this giant enemy dragon. Blue eyes attack his weak point for massive damage. Rage Racer! That costs you 599 US life points. No! I lost. Oh, cry me a river, mutt. You dweebs don't know what you're up against. Pegasus is ruthless. Camp yet ruthless. I've seen it with my own eyes. It was at a surprisingly popular card game tournament in America. Mokuba was supposed to be there with me, but since he'd been kidnapped for about the 50th time that month, his seat was empty. <laughs> Pegasus was facing the intercontinental champion, Bandit Keith, who apparently likes to remind everybody that he's from America. You can't beat me because I'm an American! See what I mean? It looked like Keith was about to win. But then suddenly Pegasus invited some kid from the audience to their table. Hey, what are you doing? Asking for help's illegal. In America. I don't need oh. help. A child could beat you, Bandit Keith. And I'm going to prove it. Are you my mommy? Pegasus gave the kid <laughs> some instructions. And in just one turn, Bandit Keith had lost. Who would have thought that a child could win a children's card game? This can't be happening. In America! I've turned this tournament into a total farce. Hooray! Hooray!
And just what was that story supposed to prove? It proves that I am obscenely rich. Smell you geeks later. I have a hyperactive brother to rescue. I didn't even get to tell him what I want for Christmas. Ooh, <laughs> I can sense you, Kaiba boy. And once you get here, I'm going to spice up your life. If you wanna be my then. Oh my gosh, we're in trouble! What are we gonna do? I'm going to do my laundry. Could I have some change? Well, in this case, guys, yeah, it's like the other episode. I feel like the first one was a lot stronger than the second one. But in this case, guys, any comments, any suggestions, let me know in the comment section down below. If you guys enjoyed my reaction, definitely give this video a like, subscribe, and share. Besides that, you can definitely join the Sparky Sparky TV family here. We check out whatever's popping, whatever's cool, whatever's interesting together. But besides that, this is your boy Leo signing out. And deuces.